And now to a safety alert. An 18-year-old from Taravella High School has been arrested after she allegedly made threats about a school shooting. And police say she made the threats using another student's name and computer access before it was published on social media. Local 10 Joseph Ojo is live in Coral Springs with the details. Good morning, guys. And although the punishment is serious, we do it does seem like we keep seeing these school threats over and over. This time, it was an 18 year old, girl, 18 year old girl here at Taravella High School, and now she is faced with some serious felony charges. An arrest made after this graphic threat, which circulated online and among students and staff of Broward schools on Thursday. 18 year old Cartina Petit, a student at Taravella High School in Coral Springs, now likely to face multiple felony charges. Students on Friday reacting to the news. I don't know why people do that for amusement, but it's something like it's, it's not a joke. It's something serious. Coral Springs police say Petit posted a threat using another student's name and computer access, promising to make history as the quote top school slaughter. Some schools like Taravella taking security measures as soon as they saw the threat. And then the teacher was like, guys, just sit here. We're going to wait a little bit. When the bell rings, we're not leaving. It comes as Broward County Schools announced plans to only allow clear backpacks and bags like these next school year. All other bags not allowed among students. It's, it's so important because we have to prevent the weapons from getting into our school. The policy will not apply to staff or visitors and students will be allowed only a small pouch for personal items like hygiene products. One of the um, exceptions to the rule will be that students can bring a, a personal uh, pouch, which does not have to be clear, and they can put their personal items in that pouch. An attempt to ramp up school security ahead of the new school year. Because, you know, I come to school and I expect to be safe, you know. So no comment from that teen when our crew went to their home. Police have also not yet announced the exact charges that this 18-year-old girl is facing. We're here in Coral Springs this morning. I'm Joseph Ojo, Local 10 News.